Hey, I'm Peter Hollins. I am a musician and YouTuber. I'm lucky enough to sing for a living. I upload music videos to YouTube, uh, Facebook, Instagram. I even have released content on the TikTok, so I'm not too old yet. And uh, I get to do that for a living. So I'm really excited to talk to you guys today about my experiences growing up and uh, maybe sing you guys a song or two. So that is who I am and what I do, but I think the best way to show you is to sing you a little tune. So uh, this first one is one of my favorites. It's an Ed Sheeran song uh, from a good old uh, Hobbit Lord of the Rings fandom. Oh, misty eye of the mountain below, keep careful watch of my brother's soul. And should the sky be filled with fire and smoke, keep watching over during sun. This is to end in fire Then we should all burn together Watch the flames climb higher Into the night Calling out Father Oh, stand by and we will Watch the flames burn on and on The mountainside should die tonight we should all die together raise a glass of wine for the last time calling out father oh prepare as we will watch the flames burn on and on the mountainside desolation comes upon the sky See fire inside the mountain. I see fire burning the trees. And I see fire hollowing souls. I see fire blood in the breeze. And I hope that you remember.
I think the best place to start so you guys can know who I am is from the beginning. I was born and raised in Ashland, Oregon, a very small town in Southern Oregon. I had a home life that was reasonably difficult because my father was fighting brain cancer. He had multiple, multiple surgeries when I was younger and so we didn't have a lot of humor. I uh, was babysat by the television a lot and so when I went to school I didn't have a lot of uh, social knowledge in regards to how to deal with my fellow peers. I was very, very sensitive and very easy to pick on. I even got picked on and bullied by my teachers. And uh, that, that is something that you don't really grow out of very easily in a small town. So I dealt with bullying and uh, huge self-esteem problems and depression growing up really all the way through until I finally got out of that town and made it to college. I do think that one of the things that helped me develop into the man I am today are the experiences that I had with being bullied. Uh, it helped me become a more sensitive, empathetic person. It definitely wasn't easy. I think one of the things that is so difficult for you to see at your age is that your life is going to be so, so much more than just the classroom that you're in or just the kids that may or may not be giving you a hard time. And there's so much to look forward to and there's so much to grow from. I wouldn't actually go back and change the experiences that I had. All the countless days of walking home from school crying, from getting beat up after school. Uh, I wouldn't change anything about my life because it led me to where I am today. If you are somebody who is dealing with being bullied, or you're having issues with self-esteem, please keep in mind that the things that you're getting bullied about and the things that make you unique to get the attention of the cool kids or whoever is giving you a hard time, keep in mind that that's what makes you important. That's what makes you unique. I am so proud of the fact that I am a nerd and a dork now because the dorks and the nerds rule the freaking world. And the sooner you realize that, the happier you'll be. I think growing up in life, the more I started realizing that I didn't care what people thought about me, the more happy I was, the more successful I was. And I need you to know that A, this gets better. B, if you're having something happen to you, there's nothing to be ashamed of. You should speak to somebody about it, communicate, talk to your friends, talk to your parents, talk to anyone, because you shouldn't be going through this alone. And just know that it's gonna get better. It's really not that cool to be cool. It's really cool to be you. So this next song is one of my favorites. It comes from one of my favorite movies and soundtracks. And it is the musical expression of what I was just trying to tell you. So uh, don't be afraid to be who you are. And uh, this is me. I'm not a stranger to the dark. Hide away, they say, cause we don't want your broken parts. I've learned to be ashamed of all my scars. Run away, they say, no one will love you as you are. But I won't let them break me down to dust. I know that there's a place for us, for we are glorious. When the sharpest words want to cut me down. Gonna send a flood, gonna drown them out I am brave, I am bruised I am who I'm meant to be This is me Look out, cause here I come And I'm marching on to the beat I drum I'm not scared to be seen I make no apologies This is me Cut me down 
is me Look out, cause here I come And I'm marching on to the beat I drum I'm not scared to be seen I make no apologies This is me Send a flood, gonna drown him out This is brave, this is bruised This is who I'm meant to be This is me So now that you've heard me sing way too much, I uh, just want to leave you guys with some closing ideas and thoughts. First and foremost, to reiterate that you need to be proud of being uniquely you. Uh, being cool is not cool. Being a nerd and a dork and being yourself is the way to be. It is the only way to be. And that if you're going through hard times, the best thing to do is to talk to somebody Talk to a friend, talk to a counselor, talk to a parent, talk to a teacher. Talking about your feelings is one of the best ways to not only understand yourself, but understand what you're going through and have somebody else's perspective. It's so important when we're young. We're in our heads and we don't really understand the world yet. You don't. We really feel like we do when, when we're young. Promise you, I was such a little punk, but we have so much yet to learn. Just know that it's going to get better. Be proud of who you are and uh, that this dorky acapella guy will love and appreciate you for who you are no matter what. You don't know me, but I'm here for you. So that's what I got. I love you guys. Thanks for listening to me. Mwah.